What's up guys, welcome back to the Fernabache Season 3 Rebuild. If you guys didn't watch Season 1 and 2, I suggest you guys to go watch it before watching this one. But let's get right into it boys. Our first signing is Danny Ceballos for free because he was a free agent. He's going to be brilliant. I feel like if he doesn't work out, we can always sell him as he is worth $22 million. Our first transfer out of the club is Cavici for $39 million. He was pretty good, but we could use the money for the new midfielders we're going to buy. Good luck to him in PSV. But just like that, we got a brand new signing in Mokako. A free agent, surprisingly, he plays for Dortmund in real life and he has really good potential. So I see a big future with him in our club. And just like that, boys, another of our legendary midfielders has left. And Zach, I'm not going to pronounce the name right ever, but he is going to Brentford for approximately... 25 million and now we're in our first champions league qualification game and we end up losing 2-1 to i can't even pronounce her name i'm not gonna lie boys but we need to make a big comeback in the second leg all right boys it's comeback time we got this we're, get, we're just gonna pull off a real madrid you know you know us fernabache with this brand new team brand new midfield but this is gonna be a tough task i'm not gonna lie I'm very nervous because if we miss out on Champions League, that's just a whole L, boys. Let's be real. All right, boys, it's kickoff. Come on, guys. We got this. We're Fernabache. Let's not forget. Let's go. Come on, guys. Better playmaking. Oh, no. Don't lose the ball there. Oh, my goodness. We're down by two right now, boys. It's not looking good, man. I really hope they can turn this around. And just like that, boys, we're in 1-1. One, one. Come on, boys. The comeback is truly possible now. Let's go. Berisha getting himself a goal. They have a red card, so that probably played a big role in it. Let's do this, boys. Come on. Let's f***ing go, boys. Another goal by Yandas. Oh, my goodness. This is going to be an amazing comeback, boys. That red card is really messing them up. Mert Hakan Yandas. Whatever his name is, whatever you want to call him. He just got us back a goal. Let's go, boys. Come on. All right, boys. It's halftime. It's 3-3 on aggregate. We have the momentum on our side, and we got them against the ropes. Come on, boys. Let's go into halftime. Oh, big chance right here. And goal. Let's go. Davi Neres, our big signing last season, gets us a goal in front of... I'm not going to pronounce her name because I, I don't want to butcher it. But let's go. Come on, boys. Hang on for one more minute. One more minute. And come on. End it, ref. Let's go, boys. We're going to the second round of the qualification stage for the Champions League, boys. This was not an easy game, as you can see. Red card for them. We got three goals, though. We move on. Let's go. All right, boys. It's preliminary round. And we go against Entrelech. I'm not going to pronounce her name good either. I really suck at pronouncing the game. Names. I'm not going to lie. But all right, boys. Let's get right into it. Let's go, boys. 3-1. Goals by Lopez, Berisha, and Andika. Let's get right into the second leg and finish them off. So we're in the second game, and all we need is a win, a draw. We can even lose by one, and we'll be fine. We got this, boys. 1-1. One, one. I'll take it, boys. We're into the Champions League officially now. Let's go, boys. W. And, boys, we just took a big L. Mert Hakanyandas, his release clause was activated in the final hours of the transfer window. Are you kidding me, man? I was planning to keep him for this next season. So, boys, we made no signings in the final hours, and we lost Yandas, which was a big L. But as you can see there, we had a positive of 73 million. You guys know what that means. Big January window coming. All right, boys, we're in the January transfer window, and I think we're going to sign some midfielders because we do need depth in there. We're first in the table by a long shot, but we do need some better midfielders if we want to go far in the Champions League. But I do feel like we already got the league in the bag. But yeah, let's go sign some midfielders, boys. Our first signing is Bubukar Kamara for 72 million pounds. Man, what a signing we have here, boys. 84 rated CDM from Marseille. He's going to be a great replacement for Crespo on the midfielder as we do need some new depth. But let's go, boys. Let's go sign another midfielder. And here's our new midfield signing, Junior Traore for 60 million pounds. 20 million or 10 million more than his value but he's gonna be a really good addition to our midfield we have a stacked midfield now boys and i feel like we can go far in the champions league with this team 
But boys, that does make up our transfer window. 133 in players and players out 4 million in Kubak and Cheshorn. I butchered his name again. So it's Champions League time, boys. We go against Club Rouge. We couldn't ask for a better team to go against in the round of 16. This is going to be an easy W for us, boys. Look at that amazing lineup. Let's check it out. We got Triori in the center mid. I know you guys heard those lightning strikes. Kamara in the CDM. Ceballos on the left center mid. But we got to take out Triori for Simmons this match as he is tired. Let's do this, boys. Come on. This better be a win, boys. 2-1. Two goals for Neil Muppe. Are you serious? How do we lose to Club Rouge with this team? And Muppe scoring two goals on us. Worst of luck, boys. I'll see you guys in the second leg. All right, boys. It's second leg time. We do have Trior back, but we are going to watch the sim play out. So let's do this, boys. We better get a win here. We haven't had much chances, boys, but here's a big chance for Ceballos. Let's go. He tucks it in. 1-0, 2-2 in the aggregate. Let's go, boys. We get one back. It's tied now. We got a chance, boys. We got a fighting chance. It's minute 70. Ever since that goal, no one's really done anything in the match. They haven't really been good. Minole has been saving a lot of chances, but you can see our players are playing pretty decent, but no chances yet. But if we keep playing the way we're playing, we'll get one soon. We're at minute 80 right now. Only 10 minutes to go before this half ends. Come on, boys. Get the ball. Win that ball right there. Don't let them score, please. All right, come on. That's our chance right there. They got to start playing nice. That's how I talk to them to play, boys. Come on. Send that shit up. Send that shit up right there. Davi Neres. Back to Neres. Neres. Let's go, boys. 2-0. Oh, my goodness. We saw that play. Oh, I got to change some people, boys. Hold on. To be fair, I don't think the substitutes are going to be able to go in because the ball hasn't gone out. But it doesn't matter. As long as we get this win and go to the quarterfinals. Come on, defend. And last minute. Come on, boys. It's our win. Come on, don't bottle it. Don't bottle it. Don't bottle it. What's going on? Yes, so let's go, boys. We're through to the quarterfinals. What did I say, boys? Byron beating Chelsea. That's not our matter. Come on, boys. We got this. Well, 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 would you look at our opponent, another fair opponent, Leicester City. I mean, every team in the quarterfinals is good, but this was a great team to get. Not going to lie. We got this, boys. I did a quick sim here. I'm hoping we get... Never mind. We had a red card, though. We had the first goal. We still lost. All right, boys, I'll see you in the second leg. All right, boys, we need a big comeback here. And I'm just going to show you guys the end of this score. And hopefully we win. I really hope we do. All right, boys, wish us luck. Come on. It's the final minute, and they're winning 1-0, boys. Our dream is truly over. I'm getting to the semifinals. They're winning by 1-3-1 one, one on aggregate. They did defeat us, boys, sadly. But you know what that means? Next season will happen. All right, boys, so it is the end of the season, and as you can see, we're at the top of the table by a margin, boys. We got 96 points, almost Centurions, actually. Man, what a season we had in the league. I'm not going to lie. Probably the best season this, this league has ever had. But when it comes to the Turkish League Cup, we end up winning 5-0 in the final. Let's go, boys. That's another trophy added to our trophy case. W. And we already know how we did in the Champions League. We end up topping the group against Man City. That's impressive alone. Like, our run to the quarterfinals was good, but topping the group with Man City in there, considering they won the whole thing, is impressive. We also made a comeback against Club Rouge. Never forget that, boys. We had an amazing Champions League season. I'm not going to lie. And then in the quarterfinals, we do crash out against Leicester City, unfortunately. But so does Barcelona and so does Real Madrid. So no shame on that, boys. We did great. Now let's go check out the player stats, boys. The top league scorer was a three-way tie between Berisha, Neres, and Rossi. Man, we really dominated the league. I'm telling you guys. Look at that. 24 goals, 21 goals, and 20 goals. It could have been anyone's. And for the assist, Crespo takes it home with him. And we had Ceballos, Neres, and Rossi there too. We completely own this league, boys. And guess what? Berisha was the top goal scorer in the Champions League as well. What the heck? How the hell did he make it up there? I have no idea, but... He did great this season. Here's how our lineup is looking at the end of the season. Berisha at a 84, Neres at a 84, 
Trier is at an 83, Ceballos at an 80, Kamran at 86. Our defense solid, our midfield solid, and our attack is solid. You guys can't tell me we're not winning the Champions League next season. On God, we are. But when it comes down to the player stats, 38 goals and 5 assists for Berisha, 28 goals and 12 assists for Neres, and 22 goals and 13 assists for Rossi. And those 10 and 9 goals for Ceballos. Man, what an amazing season by all our players, boys. But that does conclude this season, boys. Sorry I haven't been posting the Fernabache rebuild. I've been busy, but yeah, boys, stick around for season 4. We are going to win the Champions League, boys. Trust me. Remember to like and subscribe and leave a comment of the players I should sign next, boys. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care, boys.